Let's consider how to make compensation offset in Triaxis 3D Master Kit. For example, we have a number of frames as a result of 3D modeling. We have 120 frames. Let's open it in the project of 3D Master Kit. Okay, now we can preview the series of frames and we can see that all frames have offset. To create a 3D picture we need to make so-called compensation offset. To do this we select the leftmost frame and a rightmost frame. Uh, here we can see left and right frames overlaid each other. To make a compensation offset we use move images command. After that using uh, control plus scroll bar we can zoom pictures if needed, set mouse control to the point on right frame and uh, point it to the left frame. During this operation we can see that uh, both frames oh, overlaid each other. Using the buttons on keyboard with arrows we can move pictures pixels by pixel. Here in the bottom side of the window we can see the real offset. Uh, after we doing that uh, we can see that uh, background objects have some parallaxes. It's okay, It's par this parallaxes is for 3D effect. So, when we do offset between uh, left and right frames, we need to apply this offset to all intermediate frames, because intermediate frames still have offset. Uh, in the case of 3D modeling, we can use uh, operation auto move. Auto move operation apply offset to all intermediate frames between left and right. So doing this, we automatically overlay all intermediate frames in a proper position. So that's all. After doing this, we can select the needed region of overlaid images using so-called crop rect tool. After doing this, we go into lenticular tab, set a required resolution and interlace type and uh, after that we can interlace picture and create a lenticular image. Also here we have layout settings we can add so-called tune frame and tune frame type and dynamic marks. This is a special tool which help us uh, to align properly lenticular material over the printed image. That's all.